Hello, my name is Grace. I will read the Bible story. Jacob's dream. Jacob had one his twin brother issues bright right. But his joy soon melted into shame and wrecked. His old blind father was so bitter disappointed that he could hardly take Jacob and Issue couldn't stand the sight of his eater. It was only because Iju didn't want to acquest his father even. Father that he hadn't already butchered his smaller weak twin brother. Only Jacob's mother still loved him and now he was about to lose her too. Rebessa was so worried about that what Iju would do to her. Favorite son once Isaac died that she told Jacob he had no choice choice but to leave you must go far away well out of each shoe's reach Rebecca agreed honey to my brother Hurry to my brother. Your uncle Laban is the city of Haran. You will be safe there. We'll, we will just have to hope that your brother cools down and forgives you so you come can come back. So Jacob left his home and his family. In this grief, with no one for compay and no position for comfort. He sent off for Haran, saw the desert, wondering why he had. Oops, sorry. Done that he had done. Yet the end of the first lonely days. Traveling, traveling, Jacob came across a rocky, sheltered spot where he could camp for the night, weird and miserable, Jacob found a flattish smooth stone that would have to as a 
pillow and laid down to try to get some rest. Alone in desert, hungry, cold, and worried about wild animals, Jacob did not sleep well. <clears throat> He tossed and turned for hours. And when he did even totally fall asleep, he had a very strange dream. Jacob dreamed that a blind, blinding light suddenly burst from the dark night sky. The shield that his eyes and blinked until he got used to the glare and could open them properly. Then, jo then Jacob saw the light. Shown in steady sloping beam down to the ground, people in bright sharing clothes were glinting up and down, and with a shock, Jacob realized that he was looking at the Jared's case from heaven to earth, and the people were angels. Suddenly he felt God good, God himself standing beside him. Yes, I am the Lord, said God, and as I promised you, grandfather Abraham, And your father Isaac, I am going to give the land on which you are laying to you and your family. You will have as many descendants, and there are speaks of dust on the ground. Now, remember, you will never be alone. I will always be with you. I will look after you, and wherever you go, I will make sure that on you do day you return safely back home. Then the staircase and the angels faded away, and the voice. Was gone. Jacob woke up, laying stiff and cold on his own in the desert. But he knew God had been there and was watching over him. Finish. Yes, next time I I will read. Jacob the trick. Trickster is tricked. It. And today I will read. I have read Jacob's dream. And there was a one picture here. Here. Is the earth, and there is the heaven. Yes, next time. So I will read Jacob the trickster is tricked. Okay, then bye.